Hey there traders, it's Raul from AlphaShark.com and I want to show you guys the profile index indicator. So this indicator is derived from the market profile and it uses that information to generate long and short signals as well as long and short ideas. So there are three kinds of distributions that we look for. Okay, Distributions can be found right here to the left of our charts in these uh, bell-shaped curves. Okay, We want to look for three distribution shapes. We want to look for P's, we want to look for D's, and we want to look for B's. Okay. A P-shaped distribution simply means a trending up pattern and retest of resistance or higher prices. A B-shaped distribution means a trending down day, uh, trending down pattern, retest of support or lower prices. D-shaped distribution is a consolidation pattern, market trades higher, market trades lower, and a sideways consolidative pattern. Okay, any combination of these three is what's called a multi-distribution profile. Okay, and that's exactly what we have here in gold today. So here's the open of the Globex. We see a D-shaped distribution all the way through midnight, followed by a trend up with consolidation. That's a P. Okay, now all of this happens overnight. So the market profile uh, and the profile index are hard at work while we're asleep in order so that when we come in early in the morning with me, I, I start my uh, trading day at 8 in the morning. I look at the profile and I can immediately know what type of uh, trade I want to put on, whether I want to be more long than short or more short than long. In this instance, the idea was to be more long than sh short, simply because we have a P-shaped distribution. Now, what does that mean again? It means a trending up pattern, retest of resistance, or higher prices. Okay. How to trade a P-shaped distribution? Well, the key idea is to get long inside consolidation. Okay. Anywhere inside consolidation, uh, and when we see a P-shaped distribution, just find a place to get long. Get long and hold on, okay? Retest of resistance or higher prices, we traded higher, gave us another P-shaped distribution. So even if we miss this P-shape, the market was gracious enough today to give us another one. So get long inside consolidation and hold, okay? Take your profits as the market goes higher. Now, are we creating another P-shaped distribution here? I'm just going to put a question mark. It, it's not fully developed just yet but uh could be right so where would we get long we would get long right inside consolidation okay so this is just one way of trading using the profile index indicator okay just recognizing distribution shapes now if you don't trade the gold futures directly you can trade them indirectly through the etf the gld okay here's the exact same thing i mean it tracks the futures right P-shaped distribution, we want to get long inside the consolidation. Trades higher, take our profits. Here, P-shape, get long inside consolidation, goes higher, take our profits. Here, continuing with that P-shape, we'll put a question mark on that. We can get long there because of the consolidation. So even if we don't trade futures directly, we can use this indicator to trade its correlating ETF indirectly, right? So using the futures as a proxy in order for to generate an idea for the ETF is another way to use the indicator. So this is exactly how we use, uh, just one way of how we use the profile index indicator to generate trade ideas and um, how we trade it profitably. Okay. So hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope everybody has a great day and happy trading.